Hi, so I just got my Raspberry Pi working with my desktop monitor and uh, the way I did this is I've tried two methods. This um, GAMDME or however you pronounce it device will convert composite, it will plug in um, to my monitor but the signal is a bit soft and not very good to look at. Um, so what I did instead is I've got this HDMI, sorry, HD uh, video converter which converts HDMI to uh, VGA as it says on the front. Um, it cost me 20 quid on, on Amazon and it does a fine job. Now the problem is when I first plugged it in the Raspberry Pi defaults to the full HD value which my monitor doesn't support so I instantly got um, an out of range um, resolution error on my screen. So what I needed to do was force the resolution on my um, Raspberry Pi. Now you can do this by plugging your SD card into your desktop machine and if you go to um, your drive here, so this is the um, my SD card, you've got a file here called config.txt. If you open it with um, um, WordPad then you get this rather horrible mess. So instead what I use is uh, this one here which is Notepad++ and, uh, and I use that to read it instead because it, it all appears correctly formatted. Um, now ignore the frame buffer stuff, that's not what you need. What you need to do is uncomment to force um, HDMI mode. So you're basically removing the um, the hashes through in front of these two uh, lines here, um, which I've already done. And then you want to set it to an HDMI group and then a mode. Now I've put a complete reference um, list in the description of this video. So here in group one, you've got a lot of um, TV, supported TV resolutions. So you've got uh, 480p, uh, 420p, etc, etc. Um, the group I'm using is group two, which supports specific resolutions as you can see. Now I know my monitor um, supports uh, one, sorry, 1280 by 1024 at 75 megahertz. So that's the one I wanted. So what I basically did was copy this number here, 36, and so uh, and uh, DMI group equals two because it's a second group. Um, HDMI mode is then 36, which uh, I then set and I save the file. And then all I do is I pop the SD card um, out of my SD card reader and I pop it into the um, the Raspberry Pi over here. Like so. So this is with all the settings saved. A little bit awkward to get you one-handed, but there we go. So this is now running from the Raspberry Pi into my um, HDMI to VGA converter into the back of my monitor. So if I turn on the Raspberry Pi over here, you'll see all the little lights come on. And I'll just uh, select the video mode. Uh, so input digital. And this is now swapping over to analog, and as you can see, it is now working perfectly. I'll move back a bit so you can actually see the whole screen. And as you can see, you've got um, the, the, the correct resolution for the monitor um, displaying quite happily. And the Raspberry Pi is starting up, and everything will now run at that resolution. So this is basically how to get a Raspberry Pi working on your HD monitor. I'll hang on for a moment just so I can um, demonstrate the, uh, um, the GUI as well. Um, start X. And there you go, you've got the Raspberry Pi starting up there and you've got all the icons at the full resolution that the monitor supports.